This video clip will show you the grid developed for the Home Multimedia Center. The Media Control Center was built on the ambient multimedia platform. The demonstration platform consists of a table integrated with the system, which can render media and display it on various media rendering devices, including one HDTV and two projectors. Via this screen, users can control the media packages and render the content of packages onto different devices. Three interaction styles are supported hand gestures, touch screen, and a mouse. Now the user is using hand gestures to control the GUI. Now using the touch screen. The Christmas package was opened and its ambient content is being played. Can't you feel the Christmas atmosphere? Now let's see how the GUI is controlled. First, the hand needs to be initialized by the recognition system. Rotate the package ring to choose a package. Notice the feedback from the help panel once a gesture is recognized. Now the item ring is expanded. Rotate it to choose an item. Now the component ring is expanded by using the touch screen. Choose King Kong and see its description on the main panel. Choose HGTV, then play King Kong onto it. Now choose the left beamer to run another content. Notice, choosing a device doesn't need to precisely select it. Simply pointing to the device direction is enough. Now choose component iRobot and device right beamer. Render iRobot onto the right beamer. By scrolling the main panel, user can check the status of three devices separately and stop the playing content. Here are some extra features of the 3D GUI. First, the GUI background is changeable to provide personalization to the users. Windows can be hung either on the right or on the left. This allows the users to obtain a global view of window locations in a natural and easily invoked manner. Windows names are displayed in both box size in order to aid identification of specific windows. This feature helps the user to better use limited screen space when working with multiple windows. Last feature is the scaling of window size. Windows which are not in use can be pushed back where they will be small but still visible. Every panel is actually a box with six sides. This 3D box could hold more information than a normal 2D panel. Finally, the application is closed.